Hey guys, it's Robin again, and I'm here to talk about this NutriChef food dehydrator. This is an amazing food dehydrator. I've actually got it here on display for you to see. It uh, comes with a great pamphlet with a complete and total directions on how to use it. And it's very simple to use, honestly. I took it out of the box immediately and wanted to use it. So the first thing you want to do is wash all the trays. And there's the trays are stacking. As you can see, there's, there's five stacking trays, actually six. One, two, three, four, five, six. So you've got six stacking trays, trays on here. And when you stack them, they're not, um, they're, you, you kind of have to make sure that you pay attention because they don't stack automatically. They're kind of a pattern to how you stack them. And you can dehydrate um, fruits and vegetables in this. And the reason I really wanted to get this was because I've got a family of five and we eat a lot of fruits and vegetables, but oftentimes we get really, really busy and all of a sudden I look and realize we have a ton of fruit and a ton of vegetables that are getting ready to spoil. So this dehydrator has come in really, really handy for that because now I can dehydrate it, put it in some airtight bags and store them for later. When you dehydrate your food, you actually retain 97% of the nutritional value in the food. So it's a really, really great way to store your food and um, keep it from spoiling. So I did try this. And I did find that the key to really getting um, your food dehydrated really, really nicely is to um, cut it really, really thin. And you also want to cut all your pieces uniformly so that um, they all need about the same time to dehydrate. And I personally dehydrated strawberries, apples, bananas, and pears. And I just cut them really thin and I laid them out on the racks here and then I just put them together and it comes with a plug so you just plug it in and I have it plugged in under my counter here and there's just simply an on off button and uh, it did not really give a time in here on how long you have to dehydrate things I think you have to just kind of keep an eye on it uh, when I dehydrated my fruit I um, actually started in the morning and I left um, for the day and then I came back home and when I came home it was mostly dehydrated and I want to say that was about eight and a half hours. The, the strawberries um, dehydrated the quickest, the pears and bananas took the longest. So this is a pretty great unique little tool. It's easy to wash, easy to clean, easy to use. Just a simple on off switch. It does get warm. Um, so you want to make sure you know you leave it on a nice surface that won't overheat, but it did not get super hot I was able to touch it the whole time. I never burnt my fingers So this is a pretty unique dry, uh, food dehydrator. It's a great price. It's a great value. It's not too big Which is nice. It makes it really easy to store So I hope you enjoy my video and this helps you make an educated purchase